Participants in Mali's national dialogue have recommended that the military, which took over the country by force in 2020, should stay in power for another three years. The national consultations, which lasted for months and were boycotted by much of the opposition, culminated on Friday in a series of recommendations, including the extension of the transition period from two to five years, effectively ending the regime's rule until 2027. They also called on the head of the transition, Colonel Asimi Goita, to stand in the presidential elections that will bring the transition period to an end, according to the recommendations read out at the end of the Inter-Malian Dialogue and broadcast on state television. The military, in part after two successive coups in 2020 and 2021, had promised to complete the democratic transition by March 2024, but tensions have risen in the country over its inability to meet their promised timetable for a return to constitutional order. On the security front, participants in the consultations advised the authorities to be open to dialogue with terrorist groups and to engage with all Malian armed movements. Since 2012, Mali has faced growing security instability, exacerbated by an insurgency by Islamic militants and demands by Tuareg groups for greater autonomy. The extension recommendation was criticized by an alliance of political parties and civil society organizations formed in April, which refused to take part in the process. Frustration is mounting among the population in the face of deep insecurity, economic hardship, electoral delays, and recent restrictions on political activities by the authorities. The coming months will therefore be crucial for Mali's future.